The question is, should we start doing music video reactions again? We thought about this a few days ago and then this song came up and I said, you know what? Let's give it a shot. Let's see what we think. Let's give our thoughts and then let's decide after the fact if we should do K-pop reactions, general music reactions again, because I feel like I've been missing it a little bit, even though it was me who made the choice to say, let's streamline the channel, let's go down the movies, films, comic books, TV, that type of situation in the reactions, reviews, and the rants. But before we get to it, we've got to do fact of the day, page number 179. Fact number one. Beckett's is a noun. It is the little loops for a belt on a pair of trousers or a raincoat. Beckett's. Yes. Well then, now we have a word to put to that thingy. It's one of those ones which no one really thinks about, but I'm sure it's a very, very important invention in the scope of human existence. Yeah. Goes under the radar. Hey, no, Ranger of the Comic End. Yes, yeah, so and right now we're going to be reacting to this music video from a guy called Oliver Anthony. It's called Rich Men North of Richmond. Do you see the bars there? I did see In the bars. title, he's already slapped on the bars. Like, oh, I think he's got something here. It's American. I think it seems like it's a little Southern. Oh, yeah. Because the guy looks a little bit like a Southern boy. Yeah, I'm getting a Southern boy. Very gingery. Very ginger. Got strong ginger vibes. Ginger gene is dying out, you know? It's yeah. the most difficult gene to come by. So, man, this guy needs to have kids. Otherwise, the gingers are going to get gone. But let's get to this video anyway. Let's go. I've been selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours for bullshit pay, so I can sit out here and waste my life away, drag back home and drown my troubles away. It's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, for people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is living in the new world with an old soul. These rich men, north or rich men, Lord knows it all. Just want to have total control. Want to know what you think. Want to know what you do. And they don't think you know. But I know that you do. Because your dollar ain't shit. And it's taxed to no end. Cause the rich men Don't the rich men I wish politicians Would look out for miners And not just miners On an island somewhere Lord, we got folks in the street Ain't got nothing to eat And the whole beast Milk and welfare well, God, if you're five foot three is keep on kicking them down. Lord, it's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, for people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is living in the new world with an old soul. These rich men know you do and they don't think you know but i know that you do because your dollar ain't shit and it's taxed to no end calls the rich men north the rich men Selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours for bullshit pay. Wow. We came uh, into that reaction. Very off. With the wrong energy. Offbeat. I'm not sure what to say, um, because it was so juxtaposed. There was a lot of uh, 
a lot of pain. Yeah. And a lot of suffering. Yeah. In his that voice. song. His voice. Feels like I've been pierced in the heart. You can hear he knows what he's saying is truth and he believes it and it's weighing upon him. Mm. And that's art, isn't it? When something weighs upon you so heavily that you have to transform it into something else. That was I haven't heard heavy. a song like that in a long time. Unbelievably drenched in anger, but also there was an underlying helplessness about it almost. Yeah. It wasn't like it's, I'm going to go fight. It was almost... The fight's up. I'm almost what do given I do? up. I didn't know what I was expecting mm. because this is the first introduction to Oliver Anthony we've had. But this video has been going everywhere. Yeah, it's got 15 million views yeah. in a few days for someone who's not like a big star. star. Like a yeah. big, big, out there type of artist. That's a lot of views. That and is. I understand why it's got that type of traction because... There was a lot of shit in there yeah. that was being thrown about for the right reasons. The thing about boys six feet under, because they just get stamped on. Yeah. I mean, people don't like to admit that that's the situation, especially with like working class kids, but it is. Yeah. Like lower class, working class kids. That is the reality for a lot of people across the Western world. I guess this is specifically America, America. but I can attest to the same thing in the UK. Yeah. Um, you know, people like to talk about diversity and this and that. And yeah, diversity of ethnicity is important, but it's also diversity of thought, yeah. diversity of belief, viewpoint. And if you just go through that lens of, oh, black, white, Asian, Hispanic, whatever it is, you're basically chucking out all those people who might have the same morals mm -hmm. as you, might have the same belief system and you might get along better with them than someone of the same race as you because yeah. you might vehemently disagree with them on certain things. You're just boxing people in. Yeah. Based on this it's arbitrary like specifically thing. Specifically, white working class kids, yeah. boys, are so wrecked yeah. across the Western world now overall. I mean, they make up huge swathes of kids not going to university, yeah. not finishing high school or secondary school. Yeah, not ending up with diplomas effectively. Or GCSEs in yeah. the UK. It's, it's bad, man. And that's something that I picked up on through that. But there was other stuff as well. Brought up miners. Yeah. And instead of caring about the miners in the coal mines. Yeah. Making about... sure the country is ticking with the energy. Yeah. With energy prices being the way they are. They care about certain other situations with other types of different spelling of the word miner. Yeah. On certain islands. Uh, you yeah, know. Yeah. It's a weird one, isn't it? It's a weird one. I hope this guy don't get got. Yeah. Because he has a message to say, and he's clearly touched a lot of people with it. And even though we ain't American, I understand it. I feel it. Your dollar don't mean anything. It's being taxed. Yeah. Inflation is hitting it as well. You don't really have a say in a lot of ways versus what you used to. It doesn't have that sway versus 50 years ago. Yeah. My dollar is my message, you know? That was like a saying, that mm. type of feeling. Does it even stand for anything anymore? And are you even allowed to have an opinion? That's the problem, isn't it? Something else he said. Yeah, about wanting to control your mind. Yeah. Control what you're thinking and you're doing. It's like, we've seen that over the past few mm -hmm. years across the world, mm -hmm. right? And the way people come together and come against others just because they're acting slightly different. I mean, you see things with farmers across the world. There was this big thing in Sri Lanka with the farmers because they wanted to change the pesticides. Yeah. It wasn't the Sri Lankan government. It was the worldwide like agricultural yeah. system that said, no, you need to stop using this fertilizer. Because it's bad. And it basically caused civil unrest and the Dissolution taking out of the government. Of the government. It was a big, up. big problem. They messed up entirely there. And they tried to do the same thing in the Netherlands mm. and they didn't have it. I think in Canada as well. In India, there was a whole thing about the farmers and the land. It's a big thing, you know, that people aren't really paying attention to. While people are being told, sell your farmland and get rid of it, you don't want this stuff. It's being bought up by the biggest companies in the world biggest, and the uh, biggest billionaires in the world. They just are buying up farmland for what reason? Is it because in the end, farming and agriculture and food is actually going to be paramount? It's going to be the ultimate. Which is very likely. Yeah. And they're getting in while everyone's trying to get out. Is that it? Billionaires, I'm good with it. You've earned your money. Most of them have at least. Some of them are a bit questionable, but you know, they've done something to get there. Of the big billionaires, it's like, hey, is Elon Musk the best billionaire? Maybe. Does it mean he's actually the best? Does he mean he's great? Maybe not. But is he the best of the rest? He's Probably. Best of the bunch. Right? Yeah, that's like the way I look at When you look at ulterior it. motives and this type of stuff, I'm like, he just wants to get people to space. If that's where he wants, 
hey, he says money, he can do what he wants. That's that. He's not trying to change the way people think or do things or say, you can't do this. Yeah. There's JK Rowling. She just created art. Yeah. She became a billionaire by creating art. Yeah. You don't need to stamp on people to become a billionaire. That's also a weird yeah. sentiment people That's an have. Idea oh, people you've have. had to wrong people to be able to get there. So not necessarily. Maybe not. So, Oliver Anthony, maybe we need to listen to some more of his stuff because he got my noggin going. Uh, I've been thinking for the last eight minutes very, very quickly, very fast. It's been shooting off. This has probably been a very sporadic video in the aftermath and very different to the way the video started. But yeah. I'm a cold-hearted son of a bitch, and this thing almost got me teary. Oh, really? It almost got me there. I oh, felt yes. that cold chill like seven times. It went, and then it came, and it went, and it came, it went, and it came. Road. And it was that change between the anger and then the hopelessness, yeah. which really just threw the weight on and then took it off. But, yeah. Great shit. Maybe we need to get our parents to listen to this as well. Oh, I think... I think our I dad's going to be like, hey, you know what? Maybe this guy has something because yeah. most music nowadays, dog shit. Yeah. Trash. There's no soul. Garbage. Right? No life. There's no life. There's no soul. It's just haha, -ha, fun, fun, fun. And there is a time for fun, but then there is also a time for feeding of that spirit. Mm. Right? And that's what art's about. It's not one's better than the other, it's that one is actually worthwhile and one isn't. And that's just the way I see it. When you're talking about twerking, you're talking about dancing, this and that, it's like, okay. When you're talking about waps, I don't know if I'm really into that type of stuff in my music. I'm not sure it's particularly good. Are you talking about bitches and hoes? It's like, yeah, nah. I don't like that. Why? Don't like Why it. is this the case? And it's just allowed to get played for six year olds? It's yeah. like, okay, fine. But then you have to understand that if someone is talking about this, this, or that, that should also be allowed. Yeah. If there's a swear word in the song and you don't like the message of the song as a hoster of music, you can't just take it down because on the same service you have people talking about bitches, hoes, sex, this, that, the other. Yeah, violence. And you just allow that. That's but okay, if someone though. is against your message, yeah. then That's it's... That's not allowed. <sighs> Tough. Tough shit. Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy this video, please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel down there. If you didn't, if you didn't, then the Great Reset is going to come after you. You don't want that. No. I don't want that. No. She don't want that for you either. So just subscribe anyway. Now I've been the original comic. I've been nonsense. She's been nonsense. So you have been great. And we'll see you next time. That's tomorrow. If you don't know, make a video every single day. Been doing it every day for over five years now. And we aren't stopping till we get to 10,000 subscribers. So do subscribe. Pop back again tomorrow for some more quality. Shitty content. Hashtag never not here. Just how it goes. Also bring the bequas. Bequas means nonsense. Imp and jubby. We also bring that. Bring a lot. Bring a little. Do a lot. Do a little. But we do indeed bring the quality shitty content on a daily basis. So see you tomorrow for more of the same, slightly different, but essentially the very same. Once more, see you then. Skadoosh. <laughs>